good Wednesday morning, everyone. Oh, it feels so different today. If you're a regular watcher, then you know that as of yesterday, we finished our 42 days of reading through Purpose Driven Life by Pastor Rick Warren. And what a 42 days it has been. It gave us so much to think about and to apply to our lives. That book is so very applicable to life. And so we ended on a Tuesday and we have three more days. And I just thought to myself, what, what do I need for these three days? And if usually if I need it, then that means you need it. And what I came up with is that we have been talking about application, application, application. And I want these three days to remind us of to whom we serve. And I thought, how about if I come up with just three absolutely outstanding, over-the-mark worship songs? Songs that might not fit some other realm or some other topic but will give us an opportunity to hear them. And I'm going to guarantee you this. They will warm your heart and encourage your soul and be thankful that you are a follower of the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. And it makes it all worth it. Now, I'm going to start reminding you all three of these days that starting next week is our brand new inspiration for today's season. So I want to remind you to tune in on Monday and, and all week. We're going to have a really fun week with new with new graphics and things. And uh, so that'll that's that'll start on Monday. Now, what about for today? Well, the song that I chose for today is one of Diane and my favorite. It's to God be the glory. To God be the glory. Now you can find it in, by lots of different artists online. But I, so, I uh, chose today Grammy and Dove Award winner Nicole C. Mullen. She's amazing. She's amazing. It's a, a, about 13 years old. It's a little older, but boy. And she combines it with her hit, amazing song called My Redeemer Lives. This is going to stir your heart. Now, I want to read a song, a, a verse for the day on which this song applies okay comes from psalm chapter 29 a psalm of david and david wrote ascribe to the lord o mighty ones ascribe to the lord glory and strength ascribe to the lord the glory do his name worship the lord in the splendor of his Holiness. Nicole C. Mullins captures the essence of that psalm perfectly. God is so worthy of glory and praise. He just exudes glory. He is the everything. He made everything. He made these giraffes. He made everything. Uniquely amazing our God is. To him be the glory forever and ever. Enjoy this song. I'll see you back tomorrow. May it bless your soul. God works all things together for good to them that love him, to them who are the called according to his purpose. He's able to take the good and the bad. He mixes it together and he makes something beautiful for his glory. So to God be the glory. How can I say thanks 
for the things you have done for me things so undeserved yet you gave to prove your love for me the voices of a million angels could not express my gratitude all that i am and ever hold to be yeah i owe it all right now to thee Gentle 